Hello and welcome to part 7 of my Let's Play in City Skylines. So, last time we built these two roundabouts and uh, started building up this area. And um, just as I saved, we ended up running out of electricity here. Or it's been going in and out because we're just on the edge. And uh, I noticed that last episode got very, very long, so I split it up into two parts. Let's pop down a windmill there. And uh, so, they're obviously, not that good at checking how long time it is. I'm thinking uh, this time we'll expand up this way. And uh, we'll save this area for when Industries comes out, which is next Tuesday when I'm recording this. And uh, I was thinking about doing something with the roundabouts here too, but I think with the traffic manager, but I think this will do, should work pretty well as it is. Might be very different speed limits on them though. Oh, there probably is. So you've got 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 100, 100 is way too fast for this one. Put them down to 70. Uh, 70, 70. But those should be 50. Let's put these up to 70 as well. And these ones. These they are the main entrance to the to the city. And we go down to 50 on these segments that approach the roundabout. All of them. Uh, roundabout should be 40. The most important part is keeping it flowing. Uh, this one can be 50 as well. No point in it being faster. Just to have them behave a little bit more sane as we're coming up. Let's close that one down and let's get started building something. And we still have one exit left here. This one should probably be... Uh, we'll check this roundabout too and see where we're at. It, well, it should only be using the outer lane here. Or it will only be using the outer lane as it is. We probably need to add that second connection on. And I'm thinking if I go just up along the ridge here with this road And we probably should use one of these roads that are is unzonable. And no guidelines. We want to not that guideline anyway. Uh, oh yeah, that one doesn't snap. So we want to use one that does snap, and we'll update it. So we go that way instead. And see, we've got plenty of space up here to build on. Well, that's good. Uh, we'll pop this one just along the first level of the hill here. That way we know where it's going. I reckon we probably won't be building any further down there. But let's put it up that way and we'll make a small... We can use this to make a small roundabout here. And I think we'll do like this instead. Should be another four. That doesn't look the same size. Let's use these streets we're used to using. Ten across, put it up to the middle. Five out, five out. Perfect. Now we can connect them up with this one instead. There we go. Yes, we have an entrance to this area too. We might want to continue this road down this way, but I doubt it. Since we're expanding out uh, this area later. There we go, that's the first part. Here we're out of uh, electricity again. Let's pop another windmill in. 
good area there, but don't have any other decent electricity. This one's good, of course, but the pollution will cause us to lose this scenario, so we're not going to use that one. Now we're up in green production again. Let's just pop down the second one while we're at it there. We got the cash flow for it. Here we go. We still need loads of residential. Um, This will be the main road through here. Yeah, that's a little bit tight there, so we won't zone that area in. Um, I'll pop that up there. decent connection. I'll come a little bit further up there. And I sort of want to fill up this area here too. And I'll have some sort of beach, beach accesses there too. And this road can continue on down there. And we might want to continue this this road off uh, that direction so we'll just save a little bit on the hill there for it and do we need two entrances here? no, we use, we use this to make a small commercial district just up there and we'll pop probably from there that looks better and let's clean the roundabout up and pop in my roundabout roads there and we get the zoning all sorted out there and let's see we want to have some not that one up there there Let's make a bigger store there. To no, not that one. We want to use that and that and that. Yeah, so we have a small commercial district type thing going along here. And we can go in and remove this. I think uh, it's just a stupid district that one now. And we'll put this in. Also, a funny name. Um, Let's put a second small district in there. And we have... Uh, I want to get some water and power out this way. Let's just continue this one out. We cover almost everything. And yeah, we'll continue this one in case we want to develop something along up here. Maybe we can put a small trail or park or something in here and those are going to need electricity very very soon So let's uh, help them with that. Um, let's sorted everything out. Uh, these are actually a little, little, little bit more expensive than the standard pylons, but they do look nicer in uh, in placement at least, and cheaper in upkeep. So we need loads of residentials. Let's zone this in here. I'll pop this in here. I can start off using that. Don't want to zone there. There. That's a stupid little one. So we get a little bit nicer looking homes. 
Mm. You can probably put that one in there too. There, there. And I was thinking we do a, a small just check up around the town and see if we can beautify a little bit here and there. I probably want to have a beach access somewhere along here. Put some nice, keep some nice houses around here. There we can probably do that, get away with that and that. And just keep that a bit clean looking. I'll put some more homes up there and up here. Let's put all of those in. Move the zoning there, put it on there, there. And up that way. I'll oh, skip that there too. And we'll make a little bit in. Now oh, I'll make it even there. And we'll pop just some small. Let's make it a little bit curvy. Let's turn all the guidelines off. Yeah, so there's some some kind of way to get down there. Yeah, let's use that one there. That's good. And let's do the same down here. And put that one up from there. Nice. And I might be able to put some props in there later too. And can do the roundabout up here so it actually works. And we need to have that lane going there, that lane going to either of those. And same thing here, that lane going to both of those, that lane just for turning. And that one for going into both of those. Here we can go that way. That nodes to both of these. And that node to both of these. And lastly this one here. That node goes there. This one to both of these. And that one up to both of those. That way when you get on. You can choose if you want to take the left path and go through. I'll continue on. That's the way roundabout normally works. And of course we need to put yield signs on all the entrances. There we go, and the priority road all around. So people in the roundabout have priority. And lastly we also need, not that way, but from this way, they need to be able to enter the intersection. We probably don't need any crossings on those because they're not allowed in here anyway. And let's pop those off, put that one on there, off, off, off. And here, don't have any ones of those at all. And so they're allowed to continue on. Did we get that one there? No. I want them to wait before entering the intersection here, of course, but to continue through no matter what when they're in the roundabout because then they have the priority. And we'll go up and set this one up just the same way. Now we probably don't need to do that yet since there's only one exit. Everyone's going to turn this way and then go around that way. And this one's never going to get congested. Well, not yet anyway. Let's see about making a, some kind of park down here then. Or I want to have a national park thing going up here later. But let's can make a small. Let's put in a small city park here. So we need a district. We'll paint all of this area here. Should we include the beaches? We can. 
make that a main pathway down there, that's good. So let's make it a little bit more even. I don't think it actually matters if it's even or not, but looks nicer that way. And there, I think we'll actually save the park and do some beautification around here. We've got a lot of these small empty areas around here for the next episode. So we'll finish off with a small shot of this area, I think. There. Here we go. So, see you in the next part.